Hello, this is Malcolm Rose. We are currently on a 28 streak. And uh, since the last thing I won was not an artificer, let's just win another artificer. I believe this is the sixth, the sixth deep dwarf artificer in the streak. I see we got some stones immediately, that's useful. Ooh, vampiric dagger, interesting. Um, don't know if I want to eat that ration just yet to be able to wear that. Also, that's not that's not necessarily a good reason to go ahead and use short blades or anything, you know, long term. When we get another ration, maybe maybe two rations, I'll I'll wear that. Sort of venom. Hmm. Got him. I mean, this is this is good enough. Honestly, you will not you will not really get much in the way of hit points back from a vampiric dagger. Let's just drop this thing. As neat as it would be to have vampiric this early, it's just not worth it. Wow, I did not mean to eat that ration. I meant to do AF, not EF. I was trying to heal myself. Whoops. Jessica, we'll kill her with flame. I see she had a club, which might be pretty highly enchanted. Let's let's see some of these. Identify. Cool. Well, we have remove curse. Wow, plus six club. That means base damage eleven versus eight. Um, Although it's unbranded. Uh, something tells me poison's probably better. Also, uh, the club is base attack delay 1.3, it's 1.1 for the short sword. Um, so as amazing as that enchantment is, I think we're gonna have to stick with gonna have to stick with poison. Dwarf, but especially that we have plate mail that sort of makes us immune to adders. No axes yet.
taking a quick look around, see if I missed anything. Looks like I did not. Whoa, an artifact axe. This could be good. Oh, it's awesome. It's really, really good. I could even train some. I could even train some necromancy if I felt like it. Int plus seven. I mean, that's great. And our lack. I mean, wow. The game is kind of sort of pushing me towards spells. And again, we haven't found any actual spells yet. And it would sort of mess with my usual plan of tabbing a whole hell of a lot. blinking and whatnot, so if I had hasted him, it wouldn't have been the end of the world. Mm. This, this kind of sucks. Well, that's good. find out when pain gets better than electricity. I know it's listed here somewhere. Ten skill. Yeah, ten skill's nothing. So if we just if we find some necromancy reasonably soon, we're we're gonna train some. Up to ten. We're talking pre-layer, maybe during layer. I don't find any other axes. Obviously, we're not going to be using this hand axe for the rest of the game. Ugh, shafted. Oh, there's a hat. No, we're not going to deal with a hornet. Since that's on this floor, let's have full hit points all the time. None of these rings are resist magic, so that sucks. Um, rage is pretty good to have, have you seen, as you've seen from the previous games. Resist cold is decent, resist no. corrosion, resist poison, I better. So it's this. Um, hey, this is what we're looking for. And it's the super temple with all the gods, except for one. Mock lab. We could have gone Kiko on this character. It's just a matter of what's the fastest win, uh, fastest win rather, possible. And um, Mock lab lets me tab pretty hard, but not to worry. I may actually use these two wizardry and cast some spells anyway, if I happen to find you know any necromancy. Probably will. If we found. I'll clutch pretty early, that would be awesome. Because then we could cheese that throughout layer. Uh, 
three rings of wizardry. The game really, really wants me to cast spells for some reason. I'd get sticks to snakes and... Uh, well, let's just see. Yeah, it's still 96% with two wizardries on. I'd have to actually train. Wait a minute. Did I actually look through this whole thing? Forgot where I got shafted from. Looks like looks like it was D5. Alright. Enchant a battle axe, huh? He's gonna get teleported. Index of electrocution, interesting. Slave on him? Come on, there we go. I think I'm going to have to take the plus eight over that, even if electrocution is totally awesome. I'll, I'll carry it with me. I mean, electrocution is amazing, but... Plus four battle axe. All right. Let's try these scrolls. One might be brand weapon, and then we could brand that battle axe. I'll turn off amnesia. We don't need that. Enchant armor. Let's just get the hat, I guess. Random uselessness. Enchant weapon. Get the battle axe. Scroll of noise. Okay, cool. It's fine. Worth a shot, you know. Facts. I'm going to be an ogre here. Jeez, maybe I should just use the battle axe. them to be in the flames. Alright, Arbalest of Flaming, that's cool. There's a broad axe as well, I like that. I don't need to buy it yet though, or really ever. Maybe. Let's see where the game goes. Um, there is a robe. We 
can check and see if it's MR. Hmm, Arc Magi. Nope. Let's go down. We'll heal up since there is a two headed ogre. Wow. He almost won. Let's use flame. Uh, this is fine. I'll blink away if I have to. Turns out I didn't have to. Very good. Oh ho ho ho! Ho ho! Uh, I know what I'm doing. Plus zero, and I don't care. stick with this. We want that, uh, we, we definitely want Whoa, what am I doing? I was, I should not have been swinging on him. He could have probably killed me. Giant club and a dire flail. 13 damage. Okay, he couldn't have killed me, but it would have been pretty close. Just playing too fast. Whoa, what's all this? And we got a ghost. It's a pretty powerful ghost. This is good. Heal wounds. Um, I guess I'll blink. Let's try some potions. Agility, might, that's what we were looking for. And we'll just fight these things. I've used a few more resources than I should have, but I really wanted to hurry up and get this floor cleared out so I can get those items that we found, because there were a lot of good things, or I should say potentially, potentially good things. Our defenses are just kind of garbage right now, so... Wow. Wow, our leg is covered, sweet. And MR is covered as well. That's uh, that's a pretty solid find. So we can drop Ring of Fire, because we have Pro Fire. We can drop these Wizardries, and we can drop Strength. That's a pretty good amulet. Let's... Immolation. I was going to say let's try the scroll while on top of uh, the battle axe in case we, it was a rebrand. No boots or cloaks or shields yet. Gosh, that is a lot of two-headed ogres. I really want Amulet of Rage so I can deal with these repeatedly. Giant Spike Club and Dire Fight. Let me do the math on this just to be sure. 35 damage. 35 plus 13 for Dire Flail is 46, 47, 48. Uh, 48 plus GSC. 48 plus GSC is 60. He can only do 60 damage to me, minus 2 for damage shaving and minus whatever for my GDR. Crap. This is 
where I have to use blinking. Pretty sure he can do 49 damage to me. We should train some invocations. That would be a good way to take these guys out. Or at least soften them up. Oh, we have our poise, we can just keep swinging. Good, random effects, that'll help a lot. Let's try not to waste any more blinks, we only have the one left. Just find like one or two wands though. This game is totally in the bag. We're already doing quite well though. Vampiric is certainly a. It's a fun one. Really, we just need higher AC. Indeed, I will. I will wear plus three EV over RF plus. Mm -hmm. It is Maurice. like this. I really don't. Let's get up here. See, the problem is he'll just start stealing from me, so what I'd really like to do... He's gonna teleport. That's fine. I'd really like to get him by himself. And then... To just tag him with random effects until he dies. We just need like a small amount of luck for that to work well. He's confused, that's perfect. Got him. And he's got a cloak. Cool, polymorph, that's actually pretty useful at this stage of the game. Probably shouldn't be willy-nilly polymorphing orc warriors, though. That's um, they're enough of a non-threat that you know I can I'd be okay to not do that. Seems like every find it, every time I find curare, I don't find a blowgun soon enough for it to matter, and every time I find a blowgun, I don't find curare soon enough for it to matter. I'm just just noticing this. Amulet of Rage. Um, that's a good swap. Let's keep this thing on, but I can always swap to Rage if I feel like I need it. here. Mm hmm. 
Okay, I'd rather she was an anaconda. Hasted anaconda next to you at XL11 is not a great thing. It's not, not something I would say is a good, good situation to be in. That's totally on me. Could she have killed me? I doubt it. Yeah, she couldn't have killed me. We had blank as well. I had I had ways out of that situation. She wasn't about to one shot me. my MR problem solved already though I love that we'll go straight into orc once we finished layer maybe maybe even uh, this session yeah Let's see how fast we can do this depends on how easy layer wants to be stately taking of a distant clock oh boy it's um, yeah should stop screwing around because we've got Labyrinth. I'm gonna meet David Bowie. Alright, we do not have digging. Let's say, let's just hope that this is not a grueling labyrinth. Sometimes it is. might not be too bad. Looks like we're making some progress. If this doesn't prove to be a dead end. This is a little bit ugly so far. I don't really have a plan for the, the Minotaur just yet. I hadn't really thought about it. a shield soon. Mm. This has got to be the route. We're so close. There it is. We made it to the exit. Should we try to polymorph? I think I'm inclined to just make a couple dudes here, and wow, he's got an artifact Bardich. Self-healing, but that it's not really going to last forever. Um, of course, I can have my hell wings just go to work on them. All right, that's not great. Um, it's a little better, I guess, but it's actually pretty horrible. Uh, <laughs> Because I do not, I do not have any RC. This guy can easily one-shot me. I would like to pull out all the stops on killing him. Unfortunately, we don't have very many stops to pull out. Uh, I'm almost inclined to just leave this place. Okay, we have one blink. Let's think about this real, real carefully. I have a net. 
I have one blank. I have some teleports. <laughs> it looks extremely dangerous. What a surprise. Guess what? Don't don't polymorph uh, minotaurs. I have sacks of spiders. That'd be kind of useful. Even at eight evocations, I hope I could make some good use out of that. We're not going to random effects him. I could just spam demons. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to... Throw, throwing that. We're going to make demons and lots of them. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know if it was obvious by the amount of piety I was burning that I was scared as hell of that, but uh, I was. Iron Gimbal, Ooh. that is one of my favorite items in the game. It's kind of cool that they placed a Spriggan Corpse next to it. Probably a coincidence though. Source of our lack, I guess. Some really amazing weapons here. But all in all, I'm, I think I'm going to stick with the war axe. It's just too good. Although, to be honest, if I wasn't just trying to tab for the win, I'd probably use Geyer and Gimbal. help if I put that shield on, huh? I know it's a large shield, but, you know. Alright, now what are the chances, really, that I'm going to find a better shield? Pretty low, so let's just enchant that up. doesn't want to die. It'll take time. We just need to get some skills up. That's really all that's happening here is we just need to get some skills up. I could be using Rage, but that's, that's a risk in and of itself. I'm really trying to cut back on how often I Rage.
We do have some ice blast now. That's cool. That lets me kill hydras at least. Although with the demon blade, we could do that as well. Shields skill is going to steadily march upwards. Berserk here. I really want a Berserk here. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We'll put on Berserk. We'll rage against one thing. starting to look up. Ooh, it's Snorg. Let's not turn him into a dragon or whatever whatever it is he wants to turn into. Let's just haste him, because that's the smart thing to do. Just kidding. And teleport away from that. Nice, some boots. And like that, we're full of armor. Oh god. I got a blank. That really sucks. It's kind of weird that I stepped into a. or kind of unlucky that I stepped into a. Um, Aqua plant, but that can in fact happen. I just failed to use Berserk Rage like five times in a row at 17% fail. I'll just train a little more evocations up. Another Aqua plant. Completely stopped caring about Berserk. We'll just use it. Excellent. I should be using demons more, actually. Let them kill Snorg. Let's go 
more vulnerability. Is that is that scepter of torment? Yeah, we're not using that. That's that's goofy. I think our skills are finally starting to kick in a bit. See, we should be able to just tamper the win already, but it's the defense that's the problem. You gotta have a certain amount of defense combined with, I mean, basically you just have to be able to win the damage race. Ooh, scrolls of acquirement. Um, armor, fascinating. Totally fascinating and awesome. We're gonna be using stabs. We'll actually train some stealth this game. Thank you, game, that's sweet. So we can, we can do stabs with axes now. That's really cool. Um, and armor again. Some, uh, some more powerful, some more powerful plate armor. That's cool. Hmm. Okay. We're currently getting as much AC out of the helmet as we would from the hat of Sea Invisible. So we're just going to keep Sea Invisible on. I know we have this amulet, but... Eh. I'd rather have Rage on all the time. There we go. We can time Komodo Dragons. See, it just took a little bit of training. Slightly more AC. Slightly better weapon. Javelins of Penetration. Let's Ice Blast. The Hydra to death. On there, six. have a giant pile of things. Let's try to emulate them all. Oh, I see. It's a spider nest. We don't really need to emulate unless we see the corroder guys. There's some. I'm not playing around with corrosive though. Whatever it is they're called. Uh, oh boy, we don't want to be paralyzed here. Fortunately, we did take one small risk of being paralyzed. Paralysis would really, 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 really suck for this character because remember, it means it takes away not just EV, but more importantly, SH, as far as I know. here. I love it. A lot of clouds. That's helpful. We'll go ahead and use one of clouds immediately. 
Oh, and we get the sweep, the, the, the optimal in any situation almost cloud. Fan of Gales. Useful. Hey, there's the um, the rare but possible solo dream sheep sleep. Goes to show that you can get you can get slept by one dream sheep. It doesn't take a pack. It's just unlikely, that's all. But we are immune to orc sorcerers, so let's let's finish out dungeon and orc. We'll make this a nice long first session. Maybe even a layer branch, depending on how quickly I can annihilate this stuff. see one of these stabs. I think we need slightly higher stealth though. Let's do work real fast. Crap. Uh, we are taking a bit of a risk with no RF. Um, and no our neg. No, we have our neg. Interesting. Cloak of magic resistance. That that is an option if we decide to take this ring off, although I doubt it, since the only other source of our elect is another ring. So we might as well get all of our MR from one source. It's good to know that's there though. It's good to have options. Jeez, we do not, we don't have a, well, we do have a blank actually, but still, I should be a little more careful. Let's blow this stuff away with the fan. I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna go up. I mean, that's a Roka's pack. I can't screw around with that too much. as well as Roka. That's good. He can do quite a lot of damage. Didn't get the stab on the ogre for some reason. Well, maybe that counts. I'm not... Well, I see, I'm seeing a lot of exclamation points. I'm thinking that was a stab. stuff.
Okay, okay. Um, hmm, we could actually die. I, I have to blank, that sucks. two knights were beside me. Just a bunch of books. Hmm. Yeah, really not much to die, or excuse me, not much to buy, rather. I, I'm hoping that this character doesn't die. I'm not sure where that came from. Uh, yeah, not much to purchase, really, that would be useful. I guess I could go ahead and get that helmet, but I'm happy to have Sinbon all the time, you know? Uh, I guess I could walk around with this amulet on and only rage when I need it. Yeah, let's do that. Any minor benefit to AC is quite nice. I'll even buy this magic resistance. Why not? So technically, it's strictly superior, even if it's not something we're really getting use out of. All right. I would consider that a slightly early orc, since we didn't have RF plus and our hit points were slightly low. But I mean, it was it was fine. If I had done that a little bit more, um, a little bit a little bit more cautiously, it wouldn't have looked so nasty. I wouldn't have wasted that that blink for one. It's an odd little structure. It's Roxanne. We don't have any silence, so that's a bit of a problem. Suppose I could just make a greater servant. Oh wait, we don't have blinking. Oh god. That's not good. Because she can do a huge LCS. Yeah, 3d32, that's almost 100 damage, which is almost all my hit points. So I screwed up by coming in here. Uh, huh. Let's just hide behind the Hydra. She should just die, really. Don't the Magma got me. I'll heal up, and she's dead anyway. Man, no more blinking. Still things like fear and teleport, um... Berserk Rage. I 
might go enchant up this war axe more. That would really help. Oh, this is that really stupid, badly designed. Yeah, no, we don't do that yet. That's that terrible hangman vault. That just means we have an extra floor of depths, basically. So we don't go there until we're ready to do depths. That's locked off. Um, like I'm always saying, you know, badly, badly designed vaults exist. And one of the best things you can do is just avoid them until you're higher level. That one... I believe force spawns floating eyes. You know, you can just get paralyzed. You, you run into a bunch of monsters that are essentially depths tier. I mean, you'll, you'll get people, if you design a vault that way, you'll get people once or twice, but eventually they'll wise up and realize that, you know, it's just something you gotta avoid. Kind of like the wizard on layer six, unless you have the proper tools to deal with it. But it does lead to a complication. People call it being, um, Spoilery is what they call it. And basically what it means is you have to have played it before or had someone tell you that it's dangerous. Because um, if not, then you're just going to risk getting screwed in that way. one of the many reasons why it's a terrible vault but as you can see I'm immune to it because I know to avoid it it's just a shame that I bet a lot of newer players die to it simply because they aren't aware that it's just hilariously out of depth spin cycle I think it's called I could be wrong I don't really keep up on the names should be a reaper in the back of this thing Got a good stab there. Oh, right, no, this is, um... Crap. Of course it's hasted. That's okay. We'll just ice blast him to death. But yeah, we got a blizzard demon because this is in this is in a lair branch. Black layer of cold resistance. I'm happier with the large shield. an interesting amulet that wow that kills my strength though let's not wear that even if it is plus rage it's this game is conspiring to take away all my all my strength and my damage sounds like crap nice we finally have haste that's that's a lifesaver I'm starting to get a bit nervous about going into layer endings, layer branch endings. This is a Tengu Conjurer. Um, hmm, he's got a good bit of damage possible here. I can try to just damage him, I guess. He's. He's, he's Ignite Poisoning. It's not good for me. I'm not real concerned about this place. I mean, I can... I can just pop on my Rage Amulet. And, and Rage whenever there's a problem. If I go down a staircase and get tagged... 
or, or I could just drink a potion, so I'd probably do it to be sure. Shield of cold resistance. You know, as much as I want to, oh, I'm, I'm wearing my, whoops. I, I was accidentally wearing revise still. Anyway, um, yeah, as much as I'd like to have that resistance all the time, I'm happier uh, having more SH. The resistances will sort themselves out. As you can see, we're doing doing pretty well. Gargoyle Wizard. Orb of Destruction, that's not good for me. Sticky Flame's not good for me either. Okay, I'm gonna Vuln. I'm just gonna kill him that way. Nice, look at that stab, it's beautiful. Every kill we make brings us closer to, well, it looks like we've met all the uh, training targets I had for the time being, except for shields, so we're just going to focus that up. So remember, you need 25 to totally eliminate the penalty from it. So we'll just focus on that. We'll end up with an enormous amount of shields. See, it's actually went from 25 to 26 right as I was talking. So it's going up very quickly. But we're gonna go. I bet we're gonna see it go to 27 before this floor is out. I wouldn't be surprised. There's a broad axe, by the way. Just generic, nothing special. All right, we didn't get to 27 shields yet, but probably soon. Um, let's acquire armor again. More boots. Or like an R-Core. I think I actually prefer boots of the assassin. Being able to stab sounds pretty awesome. Although, eh, we may pop on R-Core again. Or those R-Core boots, you know. Once we're ready to do slime, probably next video. Unless I train a ludicrous amount of stealth and probably wear like shadow dragon armor, I can't see these boots of the assassin really coming into play. Actually, let's, why am I carrying these? My inventory is full as it is. Yet. Yes, we do. We have two blinking. We can go hog wild. Always find myself checking for lamp of fire in here in case I missed it, just because it's so nice to have. Let's, 
let's think about this. Um, I mean, I could just swing, but if this stuff explodes, I probably die. Uh, I don't know exactly what the order of operations is. I like to pretend that it heals you as soon as you, as soon as one of them explodes. But who knows if, who knows if he'll actually, who knows if Monk Club will actually play ball on that. So I think we do this. Okay, there we go. Where's my healing, bro? Come on. I'm a little shocked that I'm not getting healed very much from this. Finally, there we go on. That's, that's what we're talking about. Sweet. I wouldn't say this is the cleanest play I've ever done, but it seems to be working out okay. Next time we'll go into Swamp. We're done for now. Um, yeah. Next time we'll go to Swamp, but things are going pretty well. We're, uh, you know, these boots of the assassin. Hopefully we can get some mileage out of those, but I could I could easily see myself swapping to the corrosion RLEC boots. Especially, I mean, we found like 40 things with RLEC on them. Um, which is a little odd. But if I find some better rings, you're going to probably see me swapping to those boots for the RLEC, swapping this thing off since we have MR from the cloak. You know, and uh, just doing some overall housekeeping. But I would say we're doing pretty well. Um, you know, pretty pretty great. Pretty great set of items. Let's, uh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to try this plate armor on. That's fire resistance. Um, I'll just take the plus three over that. I do wish we had resistance potion. That would be that would be pretty good. But we have swap ons for fire and cold, so it's not really a big deal. All right, so we stop here. Um, pretty productive first session. Do swamp next time. Vaults, slime, whatever. But until then, I am signing out.